from, sir. My report. Then Deliverance forces will reach these planes momentarily. <laughs> so, the peasants made it here after all. Bring me Ezekiel. I'm here, sir. You have need of me? The Zophian rabble will be upon us in due time. Prepare to intercept them. And mind your allegiances wisely. If I smell even a whiff of betrayal, you know what will happen. <laughs>
your strength? Not a man among us wishes this conflict to last any longer than it must. Hmm. I'm afraid I cannot offer you an answer here and now. There's a village a ways ahead. I'll await you there. Until then. for us was General Ezekiel. Doesn't matter who he was or where he's from, he's a good and noble man. Clive and I became close after enlisting in the Knights of Sophia. Our houses had cordial relations before that. 
but Claire wouldn't let me near her elder brother. On the battlefield, Clive was like some mythological hero. From the moment I saw him, I knew my heart was his. And for all his toughness, when the two of us are alone, he can be quite... Well, that is none of your concern. You may recall me mentioning the pilgrimage my mother and I went on. Well, as it turns out, the pilgrimage was in Regal. This is because my mother was a cleric of the Duma faithful. It was only later that she crossed to Sophia and left me with the priory. It was sudden, and I never learned why. She simply vanished from my life. But another mother rescued me when I was at my lowest. The Mother Milla. Now I will spend my life repaying that debt however I can. I will bring the Mother's wisdom to the meek and lonely, and save them in turn. We meet again, Alm. General Ezekiel, have you given any more consideration to what we spoke of before? <sighs> Now that I have turned my lance on Jerome, Regal will not have me. But neither can I offer that lance to you. I still have no recollection of who I am, or from whence I came. You've lost your memory? I have. All I know is that I washed up on the shores of Regal grievously wounded. I was thrown in prison and accused of being a spy, or worse. But Emperor Rudolph saved me. He gave me a name and took me in. He raised me as a father would his own son. And yes, I may have betrayed him, but never would I help you do him harm. I didn't know. I'm sorry. Forgive me for asking so much of you. You are not in the wrong. <gasps> Alm, by the gods! What's wrong? Where did you get that mark on your left hand? What, this? I don't know, actually. I've just always had it. Is that so? Some time ago, Emperor Rudolph gave me what I thought was odd advice. He said that if I met a man with a mark on his left hand, I was to follow him. For that man is chosen, he said. He shall save all of Regal, and with it, all of Valentia. That's very strange. I agree. But now that I have met you, I must heed my Emperor's words. I am yours to command, my lord. Sophia, I suppose I owe you a word of thanks anyway. Huh? Why do I hate Sophia? Because I pour my blood and sweat into working this here barren land is why. You Zophians have Mila's blessing or bounty or whatever blasted thing it is. You eat your fill without working a day. Life's just one big party for you lot. Makes me sick, it does. <laughs> up ashore one day, badly wounded. She was nursing him back to health when, well, you've seen his face. It wasn't a fortnight before she was in love. Don't suppose I can blame her. Are you all headed to Regal Castle? I see, I see. Perhaps that's best for His Excellency as well. But the mountain ahead is cursed with a blight of fell beasts. Necro dragons spawn there without end, or so the travelers say. Even if you've the luck to elude them, eruptions often bury the path in stone. <sighs> What's wrong, Al? 
Huh? You get some bad pottage in the nest tent again? Hmm? Oh. I was just wondering what this mark on my left hand really means. No surprise. What with Zeke's speech about saving Valentia and all. He shall save all of Ragel, and with it, all of Valentia! <laughs> no pressure there. No kidding. Wait. You don't actually believe what he said, do you? What? No. No, I don't harbor any delusions of grandeur. But it's true that we're fighting to save Zofia, at the very least. So I got to wondering if that wasn't part of helping all Valentia. Huh. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. In a messed up kind of way. Celica has one of those too, right? That mark? She... Yes, she does. So maybe you guys are destined to save the world together, or whatever. I mean, it has to be fate or something that the two of you met, right? Fate? I don't know about that, Gray. It's a coincidence for sure, but... Kidding! I was kidding! Sheesh, man. You're really starting to worry me here. If you don't laugh it off, it makes me sound like a lunatic for saying it. <laughs> Sorry. You're right. I'm not sure about the rest of it, but... Me and Celica meeting really could be fate. I'd like to believe it is, at any rate.